Harry doesn't like the outdoors very much. He thinks it's smelly, sticky, and hot all the time. He is especially unhappy that his parents enrolled him in a summer camp. On a hike, while the other kids enjoy learning all about nature, Harry gripes loudly about the bugs, the dirt, and the walking. The other kids become annoyed with Harry, but he says he doesn't care. He claims that he doesn't want to be friends with them anyway, but then becomes louder and more distracting. Soon, he's running around the other campers, shaking trees and scaring off animals. The camp counselor, Joanna, is very patient with Harry. She knows that the outdoors is a very different experience for some people, and sometimes kids need a moment to adjust. The other kids think Joanna is cool. They like her easygoing attitude and her interesting sunglasses. But Harry thinks she is a total weirdo. While out on the trail, a large gangly spider crawls out onto the camper's path. Counselor Joanna and the other campers marvel at the arachnid at a respectful distance, but not Harry. As soon as Harry sees the eight-legged creature, his face turns to vicious glee, and he charges towards the defenseless critter. Standing over the spider, Harry raises his foot. He's going to stomp on the spider! Counselor Joanna quickly steps between Harry and the spider, keeping him from stepping on it. She then carefully helps the spider get to safety. Harry doesn't get it. It's just a dumb bug. Counselor Joanna says that the spider is not a bug or insect at all, but an arachnid, and it's a very important part of the ecosystem because spiders are excellent predators and are very good at getting rid of pests. Harry wonders if Counselor Joanna likes spiders more than people. Harry watches the spider as it wraps up a fly that's flown into its web. Harry hates spiders. Later that night, Harry continues to think about this spider and plans to finish what he started and stomp on it. He sneaks out of the camp and into the dark forest. He searches through the woods, but he doesn't find the spider anywhere. He does, however, walk directly into a spider web. He panics and flails his arms around, but it seems the more he squirms, the more he gets caught up in the webbing. Soon, spiders plop down on him from the tree and begin shooting their webs all around him. He tries to scream, but his mouth is quickly sealed by the webbing. He is completely stuck. The next morning, Harry hears Counselor Joanna and the other campers calling his name. They're looking for him. He is able to see Counselor Joanna and the campers as they cross by on the trail. He tries desperately to get the counselor's attention, but she doesn't look his way. Instead, she's distracted by the same spider from the day before. She reminds the campers to be mindful of spiders and that they are good for the ecosystem. Counselor Joanna then turns her head towards the trapped Harry. She looks directly at him and without the other campers noticing, she tips her sunglasses down, revealing eight dark spider eyes and says, Spiders, get rid of pests. Counselor Joanna then winks four of her eyes at Harry puts her sunglasses back on, and guides the other campers away from Harry. Then, the gangly spider crawls down on Harry and covers his eyes with webbing.